Hey, good morning. It's Al from Al's Rolling Nut House. Today's Thursday in our journey to Fargo, North Dakota. And uh, so last night we um, uh, stopped at a rest stop. We had dinner at McDonald's, something different because we've been eating, Karina's been eating leftovers. I've been eating ham and something. And uh, so something different. So we left McDonald's. McDonald's had Wi-Fi, so that was cool. I checked in on some things. <clears throat> and then um, we moved on to a rest stop. And uh, I pulled in by mostly trucks. And uh, I don't know, the noise of the, um, you know, idling uh, reefer units and stuff, I, I figured, well, I think we're going to move on. So we stayed at this rest stop. And I'm not sure the name of it. But anyway, we'll go outside and take a look. Uh, also, my headlights stopped working on the way, and uh, that was kind of weird. And uh, it turns out to be my high low beam switch, so I just bypassed it. So we're good for now. And uh, oh man, it's a beautiful day. Just gorgeous. Well, let's see where we are here. What's the name of this? <laughs> I don't know. We're in Minnesota, and it's just two and a half hour drive to Fargo so um, I think we're north of St. Paul and uh, a little more to go but uh, what a beautiful day the lot's pretty much cleared out I had a shower and uh, rinsed off and uh, yeah Minnesota's got some nice rest stops nice clean and um, um, I was checking out another video before I left in that truck path app. That's really cool because it shows all the rest stops, shows their TA is, all the truck driver places, um, which I really wouldn't go to. I don't think too many, like it's great for fuel and stuff, but um, a couple of them, uh, I don't know, in Wisconsin were kind of packed. Uh, one, one facility we stopped at was really small and a lot of congestion and I was like, you know, yeah, it was challenging. So I said, well, we'll just stop at regular rest stops on the highway. And so far it's been all right. We've been able to um, stay. I parked in an area. Well, each place is a little different here. In Ohio, they were all consistently the same. And uh, they had a place for RVs to park and a dump station. The fresh water didn't work, but um, at least they had a dump station if you wanted to drain your tank. So that was cool. Um, yeah, so there's been all kinds of things we've seen. So today's our last leg of the journey. It should be two and a half hour drive and we get to uh, Fargo and I got us reserved in a campground in, uh, it's called Linwood, I think. And, uh, and then we go from there. Diane is flying in later on and uh, my mom, my mom's staying with my sister and Diane's staying with us and uh, and uh, so that'll be neat. So, praise God, another beautiful day. And uh, yeah, it cleared off a million flies on this windshield this morning. I should have brought a, a long handled something, broom or something, to uh, wash it down with because it's, it was nasty. You could hardly see. So, yep, we're getting there. And then. Uh, a few days we'll turn around and head back <laughs> but it'll be neat to see so thanks for checking in have a great day see ya god bless